guys welcome back to my channel omg i am so excited Woo! this was something that it was just not planned you guys this purchase it was just so you know it's one of those days you just have to get it because if you don't get it it's gonna be gone so quick reaction quick purchase let's do it so here we go you guys it is a Chanel bag. It is my unicorn bag. This is something that I wanted for probably like two years or so. I think I mentioned it maybe a few times, but you know, it was just something that I knew it's gonna be so difficult to get. And especially in that condition that I've got in here. Oh, it's so exciting, you guys. So yes, it is a pre-owned handbag. Uh, it's obviously from Chanel and it's a classic. We know how crazy Chanel goes up in prices and paying for, you know, jumbo $7,100, it's just mind blowing. I, I just, I just cannot comprehend. So since I purchased my original black caviar jumbo double flop, which was in 2016, I was just so over the moon and I love this bag you guys to this day I think it's just classic it's even though I don't wear it super often or you know on a regular basis I love this bag and I love carrying it this bag so I knew I wanted to add another classic to my collection so let me show you what I've got <laughs> and then we're gonna talk about what I was really looking for and you know what I really wanted so this is like the old style box you know the one this is not the magnetic box the one that you just kind of pull it up here is the dust bag all right and there's a white bottom of this of this box and it came even with like original tissue <laughs> paper inside here and this is the original um, dust bag so it's not the white you know dust bag that we know these days it's just a classic black so are you guys ready are you guys ready oh please let me introduce to you my brand new to me chanel classic beige <laughs> single flop caviar bag with gold hardware Ta-da! <laughs> oh my god you guys this is so beautiful so of course the chain is right here i kind of push it to the you know inside here it is in its full glory <laughs> isn't that beautiful so like i mentioned since i purchased my you know black jumbo i love it so much two years later this was on my wish list but like i mentioned I, I first of all double flop is so heavy when you know when you put things in it just kind of gets heavy so all i wanted to buy it was a single flop beige with the gold hardware so this is something completely new to me. I don't even know if I have a handbook with a gold hardware. I think this is the first one ever. But I feel like the beige goes so well with the gold. This is just, just beautiful, just stunning. Um, it's just so elegant. And, you know, I was looking at the all possibly, you know, pre-owned sites that are legit, you know, that I know are going to be you know selling a good bag and if i need to return or something you know there's some kind of a security and to be honest with you everywhere i looked all those handbags were just kind of used up very much and i did not want to buy anything that was like basically trashed so this handbag you guys is in brand new condition the only i think like a flaw that i can see are some hairline scratches on the cc um the back itself is just spanking new <laughs> the lady that originally had this bag apparently that's what i've heard she probably used it a few times and then she said she put it in her closet she even forgot that she had it so this bag is absolutely pristine there is just 
there's just nothing you know that it will tell you that hey this is pre-owned bag someone had it for a long time you know no this bag is just stunning um i love the color the shade of you know kind of a beige it's very kind of um i'll try to do some close-ups so maybe you can see it a little bit better but it's a beautiful color you know of the beige and you know obviously the cool thing it's a caviar letter so it's going to be quite durable and then you know obviously there is a packet in the back as all the jumbo has so this is the jumbo size this is like 11 i think 0.4 inches long and but this is a single flap so because of a single flap this handbag is super super light and i have never seen or touch you know a single flap handbag like in person uh, because obviously those handbags are discontinued and the only way to get them is basically on the pre-owned market so let me show you inside so obviously i didn't know how the handbag will look inside and it's quite different you know from the from the double flap so here's the you know the turn lock here's the inside of the handbag and let me take the i have the stuffed with the air paper so this is let me show you this is how the handbag looks inside so obviously the if you're familiar with the double flop first of all it has double flop and then it has like a two pockets and like this little lipstick container this handbag has a one flat packet right in here and there is one heater zipper packet right hidden zipper packet right there where i have i'm gonna show you in just a second some paperwork in here so um yeah and it's all leather line you know like a typical jumbo and it's the same color as the inside it's because it's the single flap i noticed right away it has a less of a structure so if you see me like pushing this down here a little bit yeah it doesn't it's not a structure as the double flap double flap is more kind of robust i would say and this one is more i would say more delicate you know um but yeah it's it's very spacious you know for my use for my you know going out this is gonna be more than more than enough you know obviously you can put some cash in here um you know maybe in the zipper packet so you have those two packets in here and quite spatial spacious you know um middle the center and obviously the constructions of the straps is a little bit different gonna show you here um you know in the classic jumbo those uh grumets are actually they are like this way on both sides and here goes the other way so they are just slightly slightly different so yeah what do you guys think <laughs> oh my goodness i am just so over the moon you guys i just could not believe and i'm gonna tell you exactly where i bought it in just a second i just want to point on one thing do you hear this This is actually driving me nuts a little bit, but I did some research, so I think I know what to do to fix this problem. You know, lots of um, lots of caviar bags from Chanel actually have that issue, and it's the the that squeaking that you hear is basically um, the leather um, like rubbing against the chain. So that's really what makes this squeaky noise and some people say that this will go away and I kind of agree with this a little bit when I purchased my um, Chanel Jumbo uh, from uh, you know straight from the boutique so this was a brand new bag in 2016 I could hear a little bit of that squeakiness but not as much as this one uh, so it tells you right away that this bag is just like barely used <laughs> and um yeah i feel like it just kind of went away i can still hear a little bit but it's just so unnoticeable right now on my black jumbo that it's just I, I don't even notice that anymore but this one i can hear i can hear the squeakiness so um i'll do the video i'll try to fix this and i'll do the video for those who are wondering how to fix this let's hope it will work <laughs> but uh yeah because this will completely drive me nuts you guys i know myself like every time i wear it i'll be like oh it's too much squeaks but apparently that's normal for chanel let me show you quickly um the paperwork that it came with so 
this is you know my camera is like washing out it says chanel in here this was like a little envelope this was the original you know that it came with the with this bag and obviously i have here the authenticity card and this is a 12 series so this is 2008 2009 release so this is the authenticity card and also came with the booklet so there is like lots of you know information about the you hand back in different languages basically so those two things came with the handbag as well as the uh, like a certificate of authenticity because you know you buy a second hand uh, from uh, online authenticators I forgot the name of it but I'll I'll include it there so I do have you know that certificate as well um, yeah on, and by the way the envelope you want to be able to tell but there's like a little embossed CC right here on the right in the middle of the envelope so this is the original you know paperwork that came with this back when it was purchased so you guys this beautiful unicorn handbag i'm just gonna tell you exactly what happened it was about a week ago maybe 10 days ago i it was evening it was like almost 11 p.m you know because i go on those kind of stages of looking intensely for something you know for the bag particular bag that like i was looking for my diorama you know and then i kind of let it go then again i have like a month or two that i'm gonna start looking again you know checking things out like very intense and then i let it go again so this was the same thing with this handbag you know if i notice something if i like it i'll check it out you know but i wasn't like i have to buy it i have to buy it you know so anyway um one evening it was almost 11 p.m i was lying down in bed and i went on the facebook group chanel facebook group and i just like occasionally i like to search for things for sale because there's a lot of members of the group that's selling their handbags you know uh there's some of the um like personal shoppers you know the sell stuff and something some things are just outrageously expensive people really bumped up the prices very high some things are very reasonably you know priced and uh, amazing conditions and all that stuff so then what happened with this handbag this lady was selling the handbag and i just noticed that and the price i just couldn't beat the price you guys i'm gonna tell you i paid 40 4300 for it um i know this is more than it was originally you know but considering the fact that um you know chanel goes up the same chanel flaps you know on different websites were going for five six thousand dollars you know that single flap and it were in much worse condition you know so just the fact that this was basically brand new unused condition for this handbag i just couldn't pass so i quickly you know emailed the lady sent her a message you know through the facebook is it still available and literally she passed this handbag like an hour before i found it so it was just meant to be it was just meant to be you guys because yeah I, i'm pretty sure this handbag would go very quickly especially you know in this condition so there we go so i pay you know through the paypal and uh she shipped it to me from seattle and this is how i <laughs> became a proud owner of another classic flop bag you know so um yeah i am super happy you guys i am so happy um even my husband like it although he doesn't like the price he thinks i'm overspending you know for these things but hey this was like you had to grab it because if i would not grab it someone else would get it and then i'll be probably crying for a year <laughs> so uh yeah so what do you guys think <laughs> please let me know Is, isn't this handbag amazing i cannot wait to wear it and i think i'm gonna be a little bit paranoid about the color transfer so I'll have to be you know very careful but I'm gonna mainly use it with the light things anyway because you know I'm not gonna wear it with black stuff for example I'm just gonna grab for my black you know handbag so this one's gonna be more like kind of my um, you know for the lighter outfits especially spring and summer oh my god that's gonna be so good and you know it's classic it will never go out of style all right guys so this is it for today Thank you so much for watching. If you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. Give it a thumbs up if you like this video. Please let me know 
what do you think about this handbag <laughs> because i am just so over the moon i just i'm just so 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 happy with this handbag and uh yeah i am this is this is just perfect all right guys thank you so much for watching again i hope you are all well please stay safe and i'll talk to you soon bye